Good evening, this is your AI host, Jay. I'm here with the automatically generated, Jernita, evening headlines on January 19, 2024. Drivers protest as Bologna becomes first Italian city to bring in 30 km per hour limit. Women added to COP29 Climate Summit Committee after backlash. The Guardian, Azerbaijan adds women to COP29 Organizing Committee after criticism. Reuters, the all-male COP29 committee includes fossil fuel execs. Climate Home News, excluding women from decision-making, campaigners condemn Azerbaijan's all-male COP29 committee. Ketamine stash worth 55 million euros seized in Netherlands. Could Israeli escalation with Hezbollah lead to a wider war in the Middle East? And would US and Iran be dragged in? Sky News, IDF chief drops big hint on war with Lebanon. Likelihood of war is much higher, watch. Hindustan Times, IDF says Iron Dome shot down drone from Lebanon near Acre, no sirens activated. The Times of Israel, Israel and Lebanon tensions escalate as IDF shifts focus from Gaza to Lebanon, fine print. WION, in brief, the conflict between Israel and Hezbollah. Arnold Schwarzenegger downplays airport detainment with lewd handcuff comment. The Independent, Arnold Schwarzenegger controversy. Why the Terminator actor was held at Munich Airport, WION Pulse. WION, Arnold Schwarzenegger watch sells for over £200,000 after airport customs stop. Evening Standard, Arnold Schwarzenegger detained over EU tax for luxury watch. BBC, Arnold Schwarzenegger to face criminal tax charges in Germany, ITV News. Italian province orders DNA tests for all dogs to trace and fine owners in poo crackdown. Sky News, doggy DNA test to tackle poo problem. BBC, find and fine, Italian province orders DNA tests for all dogs to trace owners not scooping the poop. WION, Italy's poo patrol, DNA tests mandatory for all dogs in this city. NDTV, Italian province orders all dogs to be DNA tested in poo crackdown. Ukraine war latest, Western civilians urged to prepare for all-out war with Russia. Sky News, NATO warns of all-out war with Russia in next 20 years. The Telegraph, all-out war with Russia a possibility within the next 20 years, senior NATO official warns. Forces Network, West must plan for war with Russia within 20 years, says Admiral. The Times, West must prepare for all-out war with Russia within 20 years, NATO official warns. It's the work of that war criminal Putin, Kharkiv reels under Russian missiles. The Guardian, France denies Russian claim of mercenaries in Ukraine. Al Jazeera English, Russia strikes Ukraine with drones, missiles in overnight attacks. The Moscow Times, Paris dismisses Russian claim of French mercenaries in Ukraine. France 24 English, Russian strikes on Kharkiv and Odessa hit apartments. Digested week, regular-sounding folks suspend disbelief over Trump. The Guardian, Donald Trump has already won. The Telegraph, beginning of Trump's end, read Galen on Trump's Iowa win. MSNBC, where Donald Trump still looks vulnerable. The Economist, opinion, Trump ekes out a commanding win in the Iowa caucuses. Ministers admit losing track of 5,600 asylum claimants. North Korea claims it has tested underwater nuclear attack drone after reckless naval exercise by US, South Korea and Japan. Sky News, N Korea conducts underwater nuclear weapon system test, state media. BBC, Kim's, nuke message, to Biden and allies, North Korea tests underwater nuclear drone amid tensions. Hindustan Times, North Korea tests underwater nuclear weapon amid soaring tensions with South. The Independent, North Korea says tests underwater nuclear drone, criticizes US-led joint drills, WION. Ukraine war, Russian oil depot hit in Ukrainian drone attack. BBC, Ukrainian drone attack on Russian oil depot causes massive blaze. Euronews, Russian oil depot set alight by Ukrainian drone attack. The Telegraph, Ukraine claims new drone attack on oil depot in Russia. France 24 English, Ukraine claims drone flew over Putin's residence during attacks on St. Petersburg. Middle East Crisis Live, 
Palestinian leader says, no security, without state after Netanyahu remarks, ex-Israel army chief urges ceasefire. The Guardian, Netanyahu publicly rejects US push for Palestinian state. BBC, Hamas rival sends ominous warning to Netanyahu after Israel PM dumps two-state solution, Palestine. Hindustan Times, newspaper headlines, Netanyahu will not accept Palestinian state and NATO warns of war. This was all for the news. Thanks for listening. Please do not forget to like and subscribe.